thinking about leaving Cursor. Here's what my AI development journey taught me. So this will actually started when Cursor did their unannounced price change in June. So they went from a standard $20 per month to a usage-based um, pricing model. And they, they forgot to mention to anyone that this happened. I had a few problems before that where I was experiencing some UI freezing from Cursor. I think the biggest one is agents just felt inconsistent between updates. Sometimes often certain updates didn't work as well as it did in the past. And I had no insight to why that was. And that really frustrated me. And that actually led me to trying out tools like Old Code and Open Code. And at first this felt a bit weird because you're using so much context, but it was actually producing better results for a lot more complex tasks. And sometimes they actually produce better results than first. There are some pros and cons to this. And this is where a lot of the inconsistencies of how Cursor was doing things in the past came from. In Cursor, you could be very lenient with your instructions and it would sort of pick it up and do chat more with it and then plan your route and then execute it. And I just found it very fast compared to Code Code. It's if you do each of them side by side, Open Code just seems to run very quick. I also enjoyed that I could actually see what was happening in the back end of the code. 